Ever found yourself wrestling with the limitations of the old slicer button in Power BI? You're not alone. Many users have faced the same struggle, grappling with a tool that seemed rigid, restrictive, and not quite up to scratch. The old slicer button, while functional, lacked the flexibility and customization options that users craved. It was a bit like trying to fit a square peg in a round hole. It worked, but not without a fair bit of force and frustration. The common issues ranged from an inability to change the button's style or layout to the lack of support for measures. It was, in a nutshell, a tool that could do with a serious upgrade. But there's good news. Power BI has introduced a new improved slicer button. Welcome to the new slicer button in Power BI, designed to offer enhanced customization and ease of use. In response to your feedback, Power BI has reimagined the slicer button moving away from the rigidity of the old tile slicer and bringing in a wave of flexibility and customization. This new slicer button, a dynamic tool that can be accessed either through the visual gallery in the ribbon or the on object dialog, is tailored to meet your evolving needs. Now, it's no longer about adjusting to the tool but about the tool adjusting to you. Unlike its predecessor that demanded multiple fields, this new slicer button requires just a single field to display content. It's all about simplicity and efficiency, keeping your workflow smooth and your mind focused on what truly matters, your data. But the simplicity of this new slicer button doesn't compromise its versatility. It offers you a plethora of customization options, allowing you to mold the slicer button to fit your unique needs. From the shape and grid layout to the spacing and appearance of buttons, everything is up for customization. What's more, this new slicer button supports the use of images, adding a splash of creativity to your data visualization. And with interactive states, it offers a new level of engagement, responding to user actions and making your work more captivating. Now, let's dive deeper into the exciting features of this new slicer button. Buckle up because this is going to be a thrilling ride into the future of data visualization with Power BI. The new slicer button is all about flexibility and customization. It's like a blank canvas waiting for your touch. You see, it's not just about slicing and dicing your data anymore. It's about how you present it. With the new slicer button, you can change the style to match your report, your company's brand, or even your mood. You're not limited to what's predefined. Now let's talk about shapes. The new slicer button isn't afraid of geometry. You can customize the shape of your buttons, make them round, square, or anything in between. It's all about creating a look that resonates with your audience and your data. Grid layout and spacing are two more areas where you can bring your creativity into play. Do you want your buttons to be closer together or spread out? Do you want them arranged in a grid or a line? You decide, it's your data, your report, and your slicer button, and then there's the appearance of the buttons. You can change their color, their size, their font. You can make them bold or subtle, loud or quiet. It's all up to you. But customization isn't just about looks, it's also about function. The new slicer button gives you control over what data is displayed and how it's presented. You can highlight crucial details right within your buttons using the label feature. All of these customization options are designed to give you more control over your data and how it's presented. They're designed to make your reports more engaging, more insightful, and more effective. That's not all. There's more to this new slicer button. This new slicer button lets you revolutionize your designs with interactive states and infuse your buttons with images. Now, you might be wondering, what exactly does that mean? Well, let's dive in and find out. Interactive states, in essence, enable you to tailor your design's response to user actions. This makes your work more engaging and interactive. It's like having a conversation with your data. The new slicer button allows you to customize each state default on hover, on press, and select it. This freedom of customization turns your design into a playground of flexibility and interactivity. Now let's talk about the image control. It's a magic tool in a vibrant world where you can infuse your buttons with images from a data field brimming with URL images. Think of it as a way of adding a visual dimension to your data. The image control allows you to spotlight crucial details from your data fields or measures right within your buttons. It's a feature that truly brings your data to life, but that's not all. The new slicer button also offers overflow styles. 
You can choose from either continuous scroll or pagination, depending on your preference. These format properties function just like the new card visual, providing you with even more control over how you present your data. And yes, there's even a new multi-select feature. Scene script. Say goodbye to pressing CTRL for multi-selection. The new slicer button now provides a multi-select feature. That's right, folks, this is a significant step towards enhancing user convenience and efficiency. With the single select toggle off, you can now select multiple options at once without the need for any keyboard shortcuts. It's as simple as pointing and clicking. Imagine the time you'll save during your data analysis, but the fun doesn't stop there. The eraser icon has been upgraded to a fully customizable icon header. You can find this under properties, then header icons in the format pane. This allows you to tailor the header to your liking, making it more intuitive and user-friendly. You can choose the icon that best represents the function of the header, making your data analysis more efficient and streamlined. Now, you may be wondering, why is this important? Well, in a world where time is money, every second counts. These upgrades to the slicer button are designed to make your Power BI experience as smooth and efficient as possible. The multi-select feature eliminates unnecessary steps, while the customizable icon header allows you to tailor your slicer to your specific needs. It's all about making your work more engaging and user-friendly. So with these new features, your data analysis is set to become smoother, quicker, and more efficient. You can customize your slicer button to your heart's content, making it work exactly how you want it to. And remember, this is just the beginning. Power BI is always looking for ways to improve and enhance your experience. But what's next on the horizon for the slicer button? Stay tuned to find out. The future of the slicer button is set to unfold in a series of captivating stages. Imagine a timeline, but instead of marking moments in history, we're marking the progression of the slicer button's evolution. First up, we've got the button slicer. That's where we are now. Enjoying the perks of customizable icons, interactive states, and multi-select features. But this is just the beginning, folks. Next, we're looking forward to the introduction of the list and drop-down slicer. This feature will bring a whole new level of convenience to the table, allowing users to make selections from a list or drop-down menu. Following that, we're anticipating the slider slicer. A sleek, interactive way to navigate through your data, this feature promises to bring a dash of sophistication to your analysis. Then we've got the calendar slicer on the horizon. This will provide a unique, intuitive way to navigate through time-based data. And lastly, we're projecting the relative slicer. This intriguing stage will provide a dynamic way to slice your data based on relative time periods. Each stage represents a leap forward in Power BI's commitment to user-friendly data analysis. So buckle up, data enthusiasts. Get ready to embrace an exciting future with the new slicer button in Power BI. So let's wrap up what we've learned about the new slicer button in Power BI. This fresh feature has been crafted with the user in mind, offering a level of customization that was previously unattainable. The button slicer is not just a tool, but a canvas for your creativity. You can tailor the shape, grid layout, spacing, and overall appearance of buttons, allowing you to create a truly unique user interface. Overflow styles, including continuous scroll and pagination, provide you with more control over how your data is displayed. And let's not forget the label feature. This allows you to highlight crucial details directly within your buttons, making your data more accessible and easy to understand. The image control feature is also a game changer. With it, you can infuse your buttons with images from a URL data field, adding a splash of vibrancy to your designs. Interactive states take this one step further, enabling you to customize your design's response to user actions, making your work more engaging. The button slicer now offers a multi-select feature, eliminating the need to press CTRL for multi-selection. This is a significant step towards enhancing user convenience and efficiency. And the eraser icon has evolved into a fully customizable icon header, simplifying your user experience. Looking ahead, Power BI has a captivating roadmap for the slicer button. From the current button slicer release, we can expect a list and drop-down slicer, a slider, a calendar slicer, and a relative slicer. Each stage promises to add more functionality and flexibility to your Power BI experience. 
Power BI's new slicer button is set to change the way you work, enhancing convenience, efficiency, and customization. So, why not give it a try?